eight-year voyage, he had publicly kissed his wife. In Virginia, the norms and dictates were those of the landed gentry and transplant aristocracy, a place where the punishment for insulting such an aristocrat was to receive 50 beatings by 20 men. Have your tongue drilled through a fine worth 10 years of a farmer's income, followed by being banned for life from Virginia. In the mountains of Appalachia, the norms that dictated life were those of family clans, feuding and fighting over scraps of land and livestock, with maimings, killings, and subsequent retaliatory actions in a cycle of continuous self-propelling violence. And in the Deep South, the social norms dictated that the black man was a subhuman, that the black woman had no right to defend herself against the violations of her body by a white master, that it was the white man who has to be both the owner, superior, and master of all black men, because it has always been that way, because the Bible says so, and because that is simply the norm and tradition of the white man's civilization. <coughs> Oh, my God.